Well, hello everyone. Looney Farm Guy here with another new mod for Friday, February 18th. It's the Kloss Vario Pack by, I'm going to call it Melody 98. It's not quite spelt like that, but anyways, here it is. Uh, 41.35 megabytes, but uh, you get uh, six... <laughs> Uh, five, one, two, three, no, six. <laughs> that's, that's a bunch of class headers. Six headers of uh, from small to large, and we will go through them uh, one by one here. So the smallest one, the Vario 560, 560 class, uh, $27,000, 5.6 meters and they all go at the rate at the standard six miles per hour 10 kilometers per hour uh next one up is the 680 at thirty five thousand dollars there it is 680 uh it is uh, runs at uh, 6.8 meters the vario 930 9.3 meters and uh, fifty five thousand seven hundred next one up sixty thousand dollars is the uh, vario 1080 uh, 10.8 meters in width. Let's squeeze through here. And then we have, uh, this is the, uh, the bigger one. Uh, the, the first is the 1230, $84,000 at 12.3 meters in width. And then the big daddy of them all, the Kloss 1380 at 13.8, so 13.8 meters in width at $89,900. So, if you are a Kloss fan, and you have a bunch of Kloss tractors, or not tractors, Kloss, even if you have one, and you just want to have a pack of different variety of sizes, these are well, pretty much every size that you can imagine that would... Uh, that would be suitable for your farm. So we're going to hook it up to this and just show you a couple of little of the uh, features. Not a lot. It's just a header. Um, there it is. Uh, we can lower it. Uh, lowers nicely. Has some nice features on there. Turn it on. Okay, let's unfold. I want to see the operation here. Uh, yes, yes, yes. I, I did unfold. There we go. And there you go. It uh, operates as a uh, header should. Um, now, uh, we have a couple of... Uh, oops. Uh, the reel at the top adjust up and down, as most of them do now. And that's about it. Uh, for that now um, we have them operating in the field now this one is in canola and as you can see I do have it on a top liner so it will fit on other it's not just exclusive to class you can they will fit on other machines as well and as you can see it puts those uh, cutters on the side when you're in canola or soybeans I believe Ah, so we also have it, uh, had him, one of them working here. They've already filled up, because the bigger headers, uh, obviously fill, and a few of them already have filled up, so we're just going to, uh, kind of cheaty unload it here a little bit, and then hire the worker back in there, just so you can see the animation. Actually, very nice animation showing the wheat getting pulled in to the front of it. I know some of them don't quite show as much of that as others. Uh, this one definitely does. Uh, here we have the, the uh, a class with a little bit the smallest one, actually. So you can see that's kind of a nice animation on there. This one was doing sorghum. We're going to just uh, do a little bit of that so that... You can watch him harvest a little bit of sorghum here with this one. Now notice there's... Uh, we're going to uh, just drop it for a second because these... Those side things... 
pop up. And it looks like there are sensors or something that's maybe possibly for a, uh, a guidance system. Of course, we don't have guidance systems on console. So here we go. Here it is in Sorghum. Very nice animation as well. And of course, um, absolutely no problems uh, with the workers or operation of it, at least in my testing here. Um, so very, very well done. Very nice little pack. Um, and we'll just go back to here so you can see all six of them. And that's a Klaus Vario pack by Melody9841.35 megabytes to download for all you uh, uh, Klaus fans. It's listed headers for Toscano, Tryon, Lexion. Uh, but as you can see, uh, they will fit onto other harvesters as well. I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, it's only a game. Till next time, bye. -bye.